For real estate concepts made simple, go to PrepAgent.com. A land contract is a written legal contract or agreement used to purchase real estate, such as vacant land, a house, an apartment building, a commercial building, or other real property. In a land contract, the buyer makes payments to the seller until the purchase price is paid in full. This makes it a form of seller financing. The land contract functions as a security device. A buyer and a seller sign the land contract covering agreed upon terms and conditions of the sale. Upon satisfaction of all contract terms and conditions, including payments of the purchase price over a specified time period, the legal title of the property transfers from the seller to the buyer by way of a deed used to convey title. Remember, a deed is evidence of the transfer. So why are land contracts used? One possible reason is the buyer may be interested in the real estate for sale, but because of their credit history or some other reasons, they cannot obtain approval for a loan from the bank. In that situation, the parties can use the land contract and the buyer will make monthly payments directly to the seller, taking the need for approval from the bank out of the equation. In this case, the seller would not receive the full purchase price up front as if the buyer took out a loan for the bank or if they paid it all in cash. However, by the seller extending the offer of the possibility of a sale via a land contract, they're casting a bigger net for potential buyers and may be able to negotiate a higher purchase price on the property. So when does the buyer become the new owner when using a land contract? When a buyer gets a loan from the bank, they become the owner and the seller moves on with their lives, correct? Well, not exactly. When you get a loan from the bank, you do not outright own the property. The bank still has legal title until the loan is paid off and a reconveyance deed or some equivalent that thereof is issued. Remember, in this situation, the seller is functioning as the lender and will maintain legal title and the buyer will get equitable title. To understand this a bit more, we need to review what is legal title and equitable title. I always like to simplify it by saying legal title is the right to sell and equitable title is the right to use and possess. Another way to say it is that equitable title is the right to obtain full ownership of the property where another maintains legal title to the property. Legal title is the actual ownership of the property. When a contract for the sale of a land is executed, equitable title passes to the buyer. When the condition of sale contracts have been met, legal title will then pass to the buyer. With that definition in mind, while the buyer is making payments to the seller, the buyer is considered to have equitable title to the property. As an equitable title holder, the buyer has an interest in the property and the seller cannot sell the property to a third party or put another lien or encumbrance that would interfere with the buyer's interest in the property, assuming, of course, the buyer fulfills their part of the contract. The legal title to the property remains with the seller until the buyer makes the final payment. When the final payment is made and all conditions of the land contract are met, the deed to the property will be filed with the appropriate government office, such as the county register of deeds, naming the buyer as the new owner of the property. If the buyer defaults on the land contract or fails to make the monthly payments to the seller as required, the seller can file a court action called the land contract forfeiture. Forfeiture will result in the buyer forfeiting or giving up all money paid to the seller for the property pursuant to the land contract and the equitable title of the buyer will be extinguished. In other words, if the buyer fails to pay, the seller keeps all the money plus keeps the real estate. In summary, a land contract, which can also be known as a contract for deed, an agreement to purchase and sell, or a land installment contract, is a contract where the buyer has equitable interest which indicates an interest in the property and gives that buyer the right to acquire legal title in the future by making payments to the seller on an installment basis. Well, I hope that helped. And remember, if you need a real estate concept made simple, then go to prepagent.com.